Hello, this is Jeff Gennari from the CERT division with your SCI Cyber Minute. The latest release of our Pharos Binary Static Analysis Framework is designed to help reverse engineers and malware analysts gain insights into software binaries don't have source code available. Reverse engineering is a challenging and time-consuming process that traditionally requires skilled and experienced analysts. The Pharos framework includes a number of utilities and tools to automate common reverse engineering tasks. We recently released the entire framework and a number of tools publicly on GitHub, and I wanted to highlight some of the tools included in the framework and how they can help reverse engineers. First up is our toolset for recovering C++ style classes from executables, OBJ Digger and OO Analyzer. C++ data structures are difficult to reverse engineer for numerous reasons. They maintain state across multiple functions, include sophisticated mechanics, and can be arranged in arbitrarily complex relationships. OBJ Digger and OO Analyzer automatically recognize common patterns that indicate C++ style objects in assembly code. These patterns are then exported as JSON to be read by the Pi OBJ Digger IDA Pro plugin. The plugin creates annotations in a disassembly listing to help analysts understand program design and functionality. The second tool included in this release is named Call Analyzer. This tool statically reasons about the contents of memory at each function call. This gives reverse engineers concrete information about the program state in terms of what values are actually passed to a function. We also updated our API pattern matching tool called API Analyzer in this release. This tool allows analysts to quickly scan for program behaviors based on program API usage. Finally, we included a few interesting utilities geared towards quick surface analysis, FN to hash and FN to Yara. These tools generate numerous function hashes and Yara signatures for each function in the binary. They are designed to be lightweight and simple to use. We are continually updating Pharos and adding new tools to our suite, so be sure to check our GitHub site often. Thanks for watching the SEI Cyber Minute. For more information, please read my blog post or send me an email at info at sei.cmu.edu.